This is Chris, and welcome to Now I'm Nothing 1983 TV. I recently asked uh, viewers on my Facebook page uh, what game they'd like to see me play, and I gave them a choice between Clock Tower, a very early survival horror title uh, on the Super Nintendo. Uh, rather little known, I'm not even sure it was ever released in uh, North America, so I'm uh, excited to do that one. The other choice I gave was uh, Earthbound, one of my all-time favorite JRPGs, again from the Super Nintendo generation. On this, I've also gotten some other suggestions. One of those suggestions, much to my bane, was Galaga. This suggestion was made uh, by my mother, so I do feel slightly obligated to do it, even though I really, really dislike this game. I am not good at this game. And, uh, yeah. So this is probably the last suggestion for a game that I will be taking from my mom. But, in the spirit of uh, getting started, let's play Galaga. Now, Galaga is the sequel to uh, the arcade classic Galaxian. It was originally released in the arcade in 1981. And... This uh, port in particular, I'm playing on the, uh, I'm playing, it was for the NES, uh, it came out in 1988. It tells the story of Captain James T. Gallagher, who is aboard the USS Whiteship, I'm just making that up, there's actually hardly any story to this game, but uh, the space bugs are invading, we have to take them out. I just intentionally got picked up by this guy, and if you're not familiar with uh, Galaga, then you will see why, assuming I don't mess this up. It is possible to shoot your own ship, but if you do not, I have rescued him, and I now have double power. So as you can see, this makes the wiping them out a whole lot easier. The drawback, however, is it does make your ship twice as large, double uh, the target. Every so many levels, we're going to get a challenging stage. Basically, the aliens are going to come in and dance for us. They are not a threat. They just are doing their beautiful space ballet. And me being the big bully I am, came to destroy, only to destroy. And I missed one. Not sure how I did that. And level 4, very early in the game, but this is already where I usually start to mess it up. The aliens will start to go kamikaze and just start flying at me with little regard to their own safety. And I'm actually not doing that bad. I'm actually further than I've usually made it without making a life. I don't know if you just heard me jump there, though. Edge of my seat excitement. You can see the color palette. I've already lost one. And as you see, the very deep color palette gets even more interesting when the blue guys turn yellow and then the green guys, they turn blue. Exciting stuff. I'm going to try not to take out the big guys, although it may not be uh, the smartest move. I was going to say I'm going to try to double up on my shift again, on my ship again, but it looks like that's not going to be happening this round, as I'm on my last man. So, that was it. That's Galaga. I'm done. Not doing this game again. You know what? One more time. And then, as I've said, this is the very last time I will be taking any game recommendations from my mother.
So you see, what I've employed here is the back and forth and constantly pull the trigger strategy. Because there really is very little other strategy to this game. Haha, <laughs> I'm proud of that. I shot one while I was on the way up. You also want to be careful not to shoot the big blue guy carrying my ship, not to shoot him when he's at the top of the screen. And I generally fail. Stage 2! Let's try for this uh, double fighter again. Come on. Usually if you're right in the center of the screen with a double shooter, this uh, round won't offer much. I guess I was just a little off uh, center here. Because I only got, I think I counted, up oh, 36. I remember when I was a child, my parents would play this game uh, often. They were good at it. I've seen my dad make it up to oh, level 30 easily. Uh, I've never been able to do the same. And at 30,000, I've just gotten myself an extra man. And stage six, possibly a brand new record for yours truly. So I'm glad that I've actually gotten this recorded. I will be putting it on YouTube, even though this video will bore so many of you by this lack of exciting gameplay or any interesting gameplay mechanics with the exception of gravity. But again, I will assure you, this is the last game of this type I will be doing. I don't even think I've gotten half of these guys. So I'm going to try to be abducted again. I just like to try to turn them all blue, that way they're going to take one shot once they have my ship. And this guy's going to take me out. <laughs> and I get blown up, but I am saved. The game is not over. At least not yet.
And I spoke too soon. This is about the last I could stand of this game. So I thank you very much for watching Let's Play Galaga. And uh, thank you for tuning in again to Now I'm Nothing 1983 TV. Uh, if you enjoyed this video or feel you will enjoy other ones more, then please uh, find me on the Facebook at Now I'm Nothing 1983 TV. Uh, don't forget to hit uh, the like and subscribe button and uh, show me the love. And uh, I thank you so, so much. Cheers.